What's up guys? Lee here, the bartending photo boothing rental guy. And today we're gonna to talk about adding a cheap portable bar to your setup to make more money. Add-ons, it's where the bartending companies make all the money. Money. If you're doing just staffing, you're gonna break even. This is a six foot riser. And it looks like some sort of plywood, like walnuts or something like that. That's just got three, three little table adjusters. Just got some. I think I paid about a hundred, a hundred dollars Canadian for this. It just clips onto a table and then all of a sudden you have your bar. So we've got our six foot table set up and we just want to clip, clip the front piece on. It works way better with plywood tables though. So um, I recommend using a plywood table. Okay, so it fits onto a plastic table uh, but it works way better with a plywood table. So the reason why I use plastic folding tables with these versus the uh, plywood tables is because the plastic folding tables fold in half so that the bartenders can stick the table inside their car and then this six foot piece usually fits down the middle uh, of the car and then they can get to an event in a car versus me having to drop off a bar and then pick it up later because that's gas and time and it's just a big waste. Uh, this is the, the basic. This is the bar riser and this is the plastic table. So six foot plastic table with the uh, riser. I have attached some Velcro onto there. Uh, now I'm gonna show you the front that I use to put on it. So what I've got here is my bar kit. And basically what my bar kit is skirting and uh, nice looking pieces that make the bar look different. I have made my own pieces or I got pieces made for me rather than buying skirting because I want to make really long pieces so that for bartending gigs, I can support however many bartenders and however long bar they need. So it's just, I think polyester and then the whatever the two types that you get on Velcro, one side is one way, the other side is the other way. And so we can wrap the skirting. Normally this is all ironed out. So if it looks a little, a little off, it's just because I haven't ironed it. It makes a simply covered bar. So if you're looking for basic bananas bar, that's uh, that's your basic bar right there. So a table, a skirt, and a riser. So you can lay it out flat there, just so it looks better. To make it nice and rustic, I've got uh, burlap pieces that are made into uh, decorative panels that go on the front of it. So all of a sudden it can be a rustic bar. And as you can see, it's just a piece of burlap we tied a piece of ribbon around and then we attached the reverse side of Velcro on the other side and they literally can transform the bar. So easy looking, easy, easy rustic looking. Yes, it looks all wrinkly, but uh, uh, normally it doesn't when I have it all ironed out and steamed out. So to make it look a little nicer, uh, add lights definitely. So uh, put that as an add-on option. Go to the dollar store and grab some clips and then you can just clip the, uh, clip the excess pieces down onto uh, the table frame. So let's clip on a string of lights from Walmart. These lights cost me $40 from Walmart, a 24 foot strand. Okay, so the bar's starting to come together here now. We've got some lighting on the front and then the excess lighting you can just have in there so that uh, you can see what you're doing while you're bartending. So if you're a bartender and you're on a budget, think of putting something like this together. You can do this for a few hundred bucks and all of a sudden you have a bar. You can start charging 50, 100 bucks to add it on per six foot bar and uh, it's easy to travel. So if you have multiple bartenders, all you have to do is just add more tables, add more bar tops, add more lighting, uh, add more skirting. It's just, it's a numbers game. So you can make it as long as you want. Let's take it in the dark and see how it looks. So here's how it looks in the dark. Um, you know, I, I think that this video doesn't do justice for it. I think that I have to steam it to get the full effect. So I'm gonna get out my steamer here and let's steam it up. What I like about you is that you sub to me. 
If you didn't sub, then go ahead and push subscribe. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Now, I'm not super duper decorative. That's my wife's alley. So this is kind of thrown together. So I'm sure that you could find like some burlap finishing tape and just finish uh, the outside of it. Get a little crafty and more decorative. But basically you can make these things your palette. You can slap them together easy. And then all of a sudden you have an add on for your bartending business and you're generating more money. Money. And then you can start getting into more add-ons and more add-ons and more add-ons. And then eventually you'll be a rental company like me. Thanks for watching guys. I hope you liked this video. If you did, make sure and sub to my channel. What I like about you is that you sub to me. All right, thanks for watching. And as always, you stay classy.